Hey guys, Martin here from Awaken Realms and today we have an extremely exciting day for the whole company because not only we got Tented Grail prototypes that come to us, but we got final production copies of all of the Nemesis expansions, as you can see in here. Um, we got both uh, grey miniatures, so just normal plastic and sandro ones. I will be unboxing today for you the uh, normal plastic ones and afterwards we'll just show you uh, videos of the sandro ones so that you can uh, see all of them. Let me just say that uh, the amount of content that is here is quite huge and we mm, really love the feedback that we got from you on the core game and I hope that all those expansions that you can see will just add a lot of variety to your games, a lot of additional fun. We put a lot of uh, um, a lot of effort into those. So uh, we hope that it will bring you a lot of fun. The amount of components in here is quite staggering, uh, but most importantly, it's totally different type of fun that you're gonna have on the ship of Nemesis. So let's get to it. Uh, so yeah, so let's start with the Nemesis Untold Stories 2, which is the second part of the comic book. Well, it is a second part, uh, it, those two comic books are not really connected. The gameplay idea behind it is similar, but the plot is a bit different, as, I, as you can see. Uh, quite a lot of pages, it's actually more than we promised on Kickstarter, I think it's 94 pages. Um, quite a lot of content, quite a lot of awesome graphics, there will also be additional uh, 12 cards or 11 cards that I don't have with me because uh, our Chinese factory forgot to send me those cards. Uh, but yeah, but the comics is final. You can see the print quality is quite nice. A lot of cool narrative play in here. And then we got the art book, nice hardcover. And you can see all the extra art from Nemesis in here. Um, and I think that there are a lot of cool arts in there to look. Um, Another next box, let's start with the Karnamov uh, add-on, which is a whole new different alien race uh, of your enemies that you're gonna have. Uh, we have a set of rules. Not that big, but uh, the changes are quite significant in terms of the gameplay you're gonna play. And everything here is a final quality as well. Uh, you got Punch board. So the Karnomov tokens, uh, there are uh, different warning tokens because it changes and you have more corpse tokens. So uh, those are the punch boards and you got two layers insert again. So this is the place for the Karnomorphs punch board so you can easily take it out um, when you open it up. Uh, this is close, all right. A lot of cool models and additional cards. Uh, we'll get to the cards in a second. Let's start with the models. And again, we'll make close-ups for you a little bit later uh, in this video so you can see all the models, but I must say that those are really creepy enemies to have. And uh, all of them have like a hard plastic bases. Uh, and the sculpts are really creepy, but also uh, really amazing. Um, the fleshy beasts, quite cool, but it's also, I think it's very gameplay. Uh, the, the sculpts are really, uh, sorry, the sculpts are actually really uh, well representing the gameplay because they are extremely hard to deal with when you are playing with carnivores. Uh, it's, it's totally different gameplay. Um, so you got all those additional models in here uh, that will just make your life a living hell on the ship of Nemesis. As you can see, the inserts are done in a way that I need to take a little bit force to take them out and it makes everything easier for shipping. Um, and let me show you just really quickly uh, the cards. Uh, those are so you got uh, Carnomorph adaptation cards. Oh, sorry. Let me open the. It's actually, I really like this moment of opening the cards, the new cards from the factory. I'm not really good at it with it. <laughs> After so many openings of cards, I could get so much better. 
Um, either way, um, you can see a lot of new attacks, events, sorry, and a lot of new cool art uh, for this expansion. Uh, just really going real quickly, but we're very happy with the art. Those are additional. That are, it's like a little bit different from the core box, but the whole expansion is different, so they are more. Um, I will say bloody maybe. But you know, like this is what the carnivores are more or less. You have a lot of schools, a lot of flesh going around. Um, so yeah, so let's just uh, show you real quickly the close-up on the models and everything. Okay, so two another cosmetic add-ons that we got, um, Nemesis Terrain Expansion and Kings. Uh, let's start with the Terrain Expansion real quick. And this is the expansion that can actually have double layer. So first layer is all the doors and expect ex escape boats, <laughs> sorry. But as you can see, I think that we have like the biggest doors in the market in terms of the terrain expansions. Because usually you get really small doors. And also the escape pods are quite massive. So here you can see that they are locked. You unlock them and you can fly, fly away. This is how they are packed. And there's another layer of expansion. Hold on a second. All right. Hold it. Yeah. Yeah, another layer. And here you got um, eggs. Uh, sorry. So, there again, a bit like different design than you would normally see. And dead bodies. Um, yep, and this is the terrain expansion. Now we'll go real quick okay let's move just let's just move it aside here and show you the alien kings they're quite huge and are quite nice looking box uh, it's language independent so uh, all right. hard to open <laughs> those bigger boxes are a little bit hard to open again double layer board and as you can see, they are not moving, uh, mostly because first of all the layer and the second of all, they are again like push fit a little bit. So you have the intruder kings. It's really nice. I think this is one of my favorite kings. Three of the carnomorph kings. And as you know, like as carnomorphs, they need to look quite creepy and they do. So, <laughs> so yeah, really creepy, especially those huge mouths of theirs. And the Void Shitter King. Krabby-like creature. Okay, so this is the King's expansion. Um, and finally the Aftermath expansion together with a Void Shitter's in a one uh, stretch go box. As usual, black finish on the back, on the inside of the box, and you got some art on the sides. Uh, and inside, what do we got? Uh, let's just put this somewhere nicely like this. All right. So we got a manual. Uh, it's quite for the aftermath. It's quite uh, short, but it changes a lot of the game. So. Uh, all of those expansions, while while you can uh, you can get uh, easy to the table because it's only like additional uh, few pages of rules, but they changes the gameplay quite drastically. And the void shitter manual again, quite a lot of new rules and awesome ones as well. And on the back you have the rules summer, sum summary, just to get you through it. Um, okay, so if you get the medic, you'll have like an additional punch board with a medic character board. Um, then you have uh, some other punch boards with uh, characters, three additional rooms, some of the tokens, um, then 
bounty hunter and psychologist. All of those were created actually with you guys. Uh, additional room and some of the uh, torrents token and some additional tokens uh, on it as well. And uh, Convict, uh, Void Seeder board, uh, those are special tokens for the Void Seeders expansions uh, to go with torrents or uh, eggs. Um, and those are special panic tokens that actually will be in the back. All those mechanics are uh, in the rulebook explained perfectly. Uh, you have additional board for the aftermath expansions. So when your crew is coming in, this is like your ship you're starting on. Um, the other side is just black. Um, and you got tons of content, content inside in here. All right. Okay. Yeah. Um, I will just uh, put out the miniatures in here real quick. Um, uh, again, the insert, uh, double layer insert, and again, after punching out, I will just show you real quickly. So after punching out the character boards, you are putting it here. So there's a special slot for that. And when you punch out the rooms, there's a slot for them as well in here. So very, very similar to the uh, to the core box. So we we'll open it up and uh, what we have in here. So a lot of new cards for the characters, action cards and some new mechanics. If you uh, if you have additional magic add-on, uh, medic add-on here will be her card. So the small cards and the big cards, there's like a special slots in the insert for that. Um, and there's a uh, another uh, slot for items and some vulnerabilities. Uh, there is also the hourglass added. Uh, and working quite nicely and looking quite good. Um, and I will just real quickly uh, open up the cars just to show you some of the arts on them and then we'll get to the models as there's a lot of them. All right. So, yep, this is the CEO cards. Uh, Android cards. It's really nice art in here. Psychologist. Bounty Hunter. So I think this one, this one is my favorite one, <laughs> one of the my, well, one of my favorite ones. Uh, it's also cool. Like all the art, art with a with a doggy art is spot on. Um, yeah, and convict. It's actually really annoying to play to <laughs> with. Uh, yeah, and you got all the other cards have uh, a lot of new mechanics, a lot of new events, a lot of variability for both Aftermath and the uh, expansions. So later on, we'll just make a quick shot of showing you the, all the arts. But right now, let me show you some of the miniatures. And, and again, I think that they're looking quite really nicely. I'll just put this bracelet out of the medic. So here you got all the characters. And the bounty hunter. Uh, the bounty hunter and we got some more herd here is hidden the dog under uh, one of the okay so here are some void seeders let's show you the scale of them it's quite quite big um, and somewhere in the insert the, the dog is hidden oh yeah under the queen there is a dog a special place for the dog for the bounty hunter and then you got the first player cut token, which is surprisingly huge. <laughs> uh, some more void seeders. Another in here. Um, yep, a lot of cool miniatures. Uh, also, as it was unlocked, the torrents. Actually, very. They have a really cool gameplay connected with them. Uh, I think that you know, like if you're playing semi-cooperative, you have like a lot of fun with those with those turns. And the last tokens. Here you have it. All right. 
So let us do a really cool, uh, quick close-up. Last but not least, my favorite Space Cup collection. <laughs> Maybe it's a smaller box, but do not do, do not let it fool you, because those cuts are quite quite huge. So you got an, again a special insert inside, double layer, everything really nicely, really nice box together with our favorite Space Cup. Uh, it comes with four cards, uh, for, well, just arts with them, but just really nice looking. Uh, I enjoy it. I think that my favorite one would be the Carnomorph Cut or Void Seeder. It's hanging out really nicely. Well, just me open those. Yeah. So you got the Carnomorph Carno Cut, <laughs> Void Cut, our usual Space Cut, and the Intruder Cut. Perfect collection. <laughs> All right, so let's just do a, a small close-up of those as well. All right, guys, so those were Nemesis expansions. As you can see, a lot of cool stuff and a lot of gameplay changing stuff. So I really hope you have a lot of fun with those uh, inside of your uh, daily gameplays because they will change uh, your game quite a lot. I'm really excited to finally ship it your way and I hope you are excited to receive them and have some fun with it. Uh, as usual, we'll be keep updating, updating you through Kickstarter updates, so make sure to look for those. And thank you for all your support, all your feedback and everything that you guys are leaving uh, on the internet, like showing your games, making pictures of Nemesis. We actually, the whole team, love uh, reading your stories from core box, uh, how it developed, how <laughs> some of you died with your friends um, uh, in Nemesis, uh, on board Nemesis. Uh, so keep it up and see you soon. Right now we'll be showing the Sundrop uh, models, but without me talking because those are just uh, models painted with a Sundrop quality for you to see. Uh, so yeah, keep it up and see you soon. Bye bye.